Good morning, students. Welcome back to our SDR online classes. Myself, I am Shantanu, my brother. I am handling fifth standard social. See, students, in previous class, already you have to learn the lesson, lesson number two, community. See here. Already, sir has uh, given the uh, sir has explained uh, already. Sir has explained this one uh, about community. First, uh, here three types of communities are there. First, uh, meaning of the community. Answers. 
you should write in your textbook answers okay see take pencil here page number 32 i want to write on the board you should write in your textbook understood now you write it see here first point uh, what a first question is what they are here what are the features of community what are the features of community now only i say what are the features of community now you should write in your textbook page number 32 students uh, here in textbook all of you whatever the activities they have to give us you have to try that one we will also give the notes and you have to try that one that's why you see here page number 32 uh, here question answers are there i will write on the board you should write in your textbook okay see first one all of you take out your classwork and take one pencil you should uh, you should write with the pencil only uh, what i am going to give on the board you should write in the your textbook okay See here, first question, what are the features of community? Page number 32. Page number 32. See here, what are the first page number 32? Page number 32. See, first question is, what they have to given here, what are the features of community? What are the features of what are the features of community? What are the features of community? Any three. Any three. See students. You know already this one. Understood? First question. Now only I explain this three points. Sir. See here. What are the features of communities? Means that you should write in your textbook. First point is the futures of community are the futures of community are first. Next, see 
page number 32 page number 32 sorry page number 33 here write the aspects identified by you in the pictures given see here identified aspect here given three rural community urban community and tribal community here three types of community already they have given here but uh, you have to write here you have to see the pictures what are there in the pictures you write it uh, identify aspect means here first you have to write uh, it is uh, activities means uh, in the rural community the people will work in infinite we see small herds and blacksmith poultry etc we have to see in, seeing in a rural community this uh, identify the aspect this rural community and next one uh, urban community see here you have to write you only see here identify aspect means only you have to see the pictures you have to identify whatever the pictures are there you should write in the textbook understood you have to fill up your textbook after the uh, lesson means after the syllabus i want to see you once again i want to check your textbook okay huh. see here urban community see pictures what are the what are what you are seeing in the urban community See here, this picture you have to see and write about this picture. What you have to see in the picture. See, uh, in the urban community, people will work in different jobs and uh, they have to work in the um, they have to work in school, big school, and, uh, and they have to uh, search for jobs and uh, they have to go in for education. Means they have to go in outside uh, business. And uh, they have the big buildings we have to see here, and bus, uh, autos, these are we have to see in this uh, picture. That's why you should write in the area urban community. Understood? Understood, students? Uh, it is activities for you only. Only textbook you are there, not in classwork. Uh, you have to write in the textbook. Okay? And uh, travel community. See here this picture travel community. Uh, what you have to see in this uh, picture? What you have to uh, see this one, see what they have to do in this picture. Uh, in the tribal community, people so they cannot be a dress. And uh, they have to uh, eat raw fruits. Means raw, raw meat also they have to eat. They hunt the animals and they have to eat. And you have to see this picture. What you have to see in this picture, you have to write uh, in your textbook. Understood, students? Write it now. Hmm. After you have to think, uh, you have to see the picture and write it this. There are different communities like rural community, urban community, and tribal communities. Different types of communities are there, and they have to give an already pictures. What you have to think in this picture means so whatever are there in the pictures are there, you should write what you have to see in that one. Means you have to see, I, I am seeing bus and autos. Yes, you should write in the textbook. Okay. And the next one is page number 30. Page number 34. Here, page number agriculture activities and non-agriculture activities. Is there no? Huh? See here. Page number 34. Agriculture activities and non-agriculture activities.
copy Our students, next, see here, page number 35, page number 35, see page number 35, make a list of implement required by a farmer for agricultural activities, for whom do we get them, right, in the space given below, already they have to give the space, for equipments, for whom, means agriculture activities are there, Equipment and for whom? This one, you only you have to think and write what are the agriculture activities. Means agriculture things are there. You should write here, for example, what is there? Sorry, in here, uh, pot, uh, for example, uh, table. Table is there. Table means a carpenter. Like that. And here, you have to write you only. This one activities for you only. You have to think and write. Okay? Page number 35. You only write this one. And next, page number 36. Page number 36. Answer the following questions each. Answer the following questions each. See, open your page number 36 textbook. Write the various occupations found in the villages. What you have to found in the villages? See, diary. Now only I read it. Means I told her. Now, what are the various occupations in the rural communities? In villages. Rural community means the rural means it is a village. Small town. It is. And see, here, write the various occupations found in a villages. Means write down words here. See, that question, I want to write down the word, write the answers. Answer the following questions each. See here, the first question is, first question, write the various, write the various occupations occupations Found in villages. Villages. What do you want to found in the villages? See here. Daily farming. Daily. Maybe. 
and electricity, etc. These are the problems are faced in the villages. Right now. Next question. Third question. Write about any one programs implemented by the government for rural development. Third question. It is write about any one program implemented by the government for rural development. Means uh, what development has taken government? You see here, first Sarva Shikshana Abhiyana. But here they have to give up any one program. But here five programs are there. But you should write out only one program. Uh, one is a Sarva Shikshana Abhiyana. Nirmala Grama Yojana, the Nirmala Grama Yojana. And uh, Sarva uh, Rojgar Yojana. Rojgar Yojana. And uh, Bhagya Lakshmi Yojana. Ashra Yojana also. Five parts means so five Yojanas they have to uh, development for the village peoples. See, first one you write down only one point is there. You should write the one point Sarva Shikshana Abhyana. I will not write, write the, this is third question. You write it Sarva Shikshana Abhyana. Third one is Sarva Shikshana Abhyana. Can I write on the board? This is third question. Now you have to write. I will write a senior. Third question. Third question is write about any one program. Write about any one program any one program implemented 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 by the by the government by the government by the government for rural development for rural development for rural development see students here, the third question is uh, write about any one program implemented by the government for rural development. Means uh, now only I said here five points are there, five are there, but uh, here they have to give out here any one, any one. That's why you should write uh, uh, any one you have to write. Sarva Shikshana Abhyana you have to write, uh, or Rosgar Yojana you should write, Nirmala Grama Yojana you should write, uh, or uh, here, Bhagya Lakshmi Yojana, you have to write up. And last one is Ashra Yojana, you have to write. Anyone you should write. See, I want to write on the board this answer. Last question answer is Bhagya Lakshmi Yojana. Bhagya Lakshmi. Bhagya Lakshmi. Bhagya Lakshmi Yojana. Bhagya Lakshmi Yojana. Anyone, anyone needs to write it. Write about any one program implemented by the program for rural development. Means here you should write only one Bhagya, Bhagya Lakshmi. You have to write Bhagya Lakshmi Yojana. These questions are over, boys. Sorry, the students, over these questions. Next, see here. I want to give you class work now for rural community. Rural community. Already, sir, has teased this lesson now. Rural community. Three parts are there. One is rural community, urban community, and the tribal community. 
first rural community after we want to give the question answer next urban community we have to teach after we have to give the question answer next tribal community we have to teach the lesson after we have to give the question answer like that three points means here rural community question answer i will give now understood now uh, textbook activities is over next class work i want to give you all of you open your class work and uh, right rural community means first lesson number 2 community rural community 2.1 i want to write on the board wait Community, lesson number two, community. See students here. Community having three types. Community and tribal community. See lesson number two is there, no? That's why you should write the three parts are there. Means three types are there. Rural community two point one and urban community two point two. Tribal community two point three. Like that. One and one B means one type we have to explain means that we don't have to give the question answer. And next uh, urban community we have to listen that uh, teaching the lesson already over means that we have to give the question answer. Tribal community. Lesson teaching over means we have to give the question answer. Like that, we have to write rural community two point one. Two point one. First week. Fill in the blanks. First, the main future of rural community is interdependence. The main future of the main the main future of. Rural community is community is interdependence. Total 
the population will be villages. See here, students. See here, second fill in the blanks. In India, 72% of the total population live in the villages. Means that what to dash? And the third one is the major occupation of rural community is agriculture. The major occupation of the rural community is the major occupation. See students, the third one is the, the major occupation of rural community is agriculture. The dash agriculture. The major occupation, the 
Tapi jadi occupation apa? Rural community is agriculture. Tapi jadi occupation apa? Rural community is the agriculture. And the for money is seventy percent of people depend upon agriculture in rural areas. And last one is a fifth agriculture activities are totally depend on a rain. See these five points. Means the five fill in the blanks are there. You have to write in your classwork. And next week, math the following are there. I will give the next class because uh, now uh, fill in the blanks are there. Next class, uh, I want to give the math the following. Understood, students? All of you write in your classwork clearly and completely. Okay. Thank you.